Okay, this midnight green color has puzzled me for years and I finally figured it out. And I'm gonna share with you all the colors that I mix so I can achieve this color. All right, so I need to make icing that is this midnight green. It's kind of like the Philadelphia Eagles green, and it has always been a little challenging to me to achieve this color. So let's see what we can do with this. I can link my recipe. This is American buttercream. I can link this below. And what I like to do, you have to pick apart the color. So this is not just green. It looks like it is on the bluer side of green and it is dark so there's a little bit of black and it looks like it's a little teal. So I have all those colors here. I have leaf green, I have teal, black, and royal blue. So <laughs> achieving these colors can be a little tricky so I'm just gonna start by adding a little bit of each color and seeing where it gets me. So adding a nice squeeze of teal, a nice squeeze. <laughs> And then a little bit of every other color and just seeing how it turns out. Be careful with the black. If you add too much black, then it's going to start to look black. So black, just a little tiny bit. All right, mixing this all around. I, I like to use a spatula when I'm mixing this just because it scrapes the sides a little better. All right, now holding this next to each other, that is, it's pretty good, but it still looks like it's too light, right? Like it needs to darken up a little bit. So I'm going to add a little more black. Just a drop and then mix it around. And I still feel like it looks a little, like it needs to be a little bit darker. Just adding a little bit more black. So the most I added was teal. And then I added just a little bit of royal blue and leaf green. Added a little more black than the blue and the green. That's a pretty good match. I'm not going to get it much closer than that. And here is your midnight green, Philadelphia Eagles green colored icing. Okay, usually I don't do an outro for these short videos, but I seriously, I need to pat myself on the back because look how close this match is. Oh, seriously, like bravo, bravo to me. <laughs> Pat on my back. Like I, it, it's just one of those colors that is so difficult to break down. And for some, like I'm really good at breaking down colors, but this one always got to me. So I think it was the addition of a little bit of royal blue that really made the difference because I never really added that before. So just to recap that midnight green, you, I use, I, I don't want to break down the parts because I just squirt some in there, <laughs> but it was, um, you know, a lot of teal and a little bit less of black and then a tiny bit of the leaf green and a tiny bit of royal blue. And that's what you need. I just recommend adding a little bit of each start to start, mix it together, see what color you get, and then add a little bit more as needed. So if you need to achieve this beautiful midnight green, maybe you're making an Eagles cake, go Eagles. These are the colors that you need to mix it. So that's it for now. If you have any questions or comments, leave them below and I will get back to you. You can follow me on social media. I'm on Instagram and Facebook and on my website, I will link everything below. And if you wanna stick around, you can watch these videos next and hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Please like this video if you liked it, and I will see you on the next one. Bye.